Oh, no, well, here's the deal, Michael. Uh, first of all, I always knew he was dumb. Uh, here's what cops always say. They appreciate dumb criminals because they are dumb. Because yes. they do dumb-ish. That, yep. That's what this fool did. You're, keep, you're keeping documents that lays out the country's nuclear capabilities? You've got documents that dictate how our allies are going to respond to a first strike? Dude! This is not, oh, I kept a letter from the leader of North Korea. No, you literally have documents showing the nuclear capabilities of the United States. Hell yes, you're going to get indicted. Absolutely, Roland. And, not on t and, and on top of that, obstruction of justice as well. So if you're absolutely correct. If he had just handed the records back when the National Archives first asked for them, this would not be a story. But my favorite type of white supremacist is a dumbass white supremacist. And Donald Trump is my favorite type of white supremacist. This is, uh, as I explained to many people here on this show, as well as on uh, the African History Network show, this is a much more straightforward case than the January 6th insurrection. There are going to be charges coming from that. But this is not a who done it. This is a you did it. The documents were at Mar-a-Lago. Donald Trump admitted they were at Mar-a-Lago. He admitted he took the documents. He said he had every right to took the doc take the documents. And he said, I want my documents back as well. So, you know, if, if mess around and find out was a person, it would be Donald Trump. And this is, you know, you, you've had many Republicans who said this is a sad day for America, uh, like uh, punk-ass Kevin right. Park, things like this. No, this is All a right. very good day for America. This is a good day for the rule of law. This is a day to show that no man or woman is above the law, even a former president. So, uh, so I've been following this. I told you back in November 2022, Roland, right here on the show, when Special Counsel Jack Smith was uh, appointed by Attorney General Merrick Garland, that was the right thing to do. Garland followed the Department of Justice policy, and I said this is not going to take very long. This is going to lead to an indictment. And uh, just so people understand, President Biden did not indict uh, Donald Trump. It was, a, it was a grand jury made up of U.S. citizens. Head and die